Hi guys, I'm Zaila Avangard, the winner of the 2021 Scripps National Spelling Bee, and I would like to introduce you to my new book, It's Not Bragging, If It's True, How to Be Awesome at Life. I wanted to write this book because as I go through my life, I have a lot of little tips and models in my life that I like to think about when I'm going through a moment of adversity. And I kind of wanted to put this into like a nice little format for preteens and teenagers because as we all know, preteens and teenagers struggle and I'm here to help them out. In my book, I share nine tips and I'm going to share with you really quickly two of my favorites. So the first one is make friends with chaos. In make friends with chaos, I kind of talk about like how when I was studying for the 2021 Scripps National Spelling Bee, I was also studying with my baby brother Wonder, who's about two years old at the time, climbing on me, banging on my keyboard, slobbering on me, breaking my computer monitors with spoons, etc, etc. So I always only half facetiously like to say that I knew if I could spell 500 straight words correctly with a baby on me, I knew that when I got onto a stage that was kept very quiet, I knew I could spell one word really well. The other tip that I want to talk about is choose your opponent. In choose your opponent, I kind of talk about how I like to always have a plan of attack. I don't just go straight at the problem, I kind of like to find another way of doing it if there's a better way of doing it. Also, kind of related to that, I talk about my sister for how I became a very great speller, which is called root words. Now, I could talk about this for hours and hours and hours, but I'm not going to because I don't have hours. Roughly, a rough outline of it is that basically root words are kind of like the building blocks of thousands of words. Not every word you get in the spelling bee has roots, but a whole bunch of them will and it's really good to know them and I was obsessed, I was a complete master of roots and I basically was finding new roots basically as I studied. So uh, yeah, roots were definitely a big part of how I became a great speller. And I go over that a bit and more in detail in my chapter, Choose Your Opponent. Now, I'm going to cheat a little bit to talk about another book that I have coming out which is called Words of Wonder from Z to A. This book is geared towards more, you know, picture book audiences. So I'm going to talk about really quickly my favorite word from that book, which is comprised of 26 letters with words attached to them, the 26 letters of the alphabet, with words attached to them going over my favorite words that were most important to me as a child. So my favorite letter is D with the word dream. In that book, to roughly paraphrase here, the line goes, Dream is a little kid standing in front of that giant bookshelf in the living room, looking with wonder at all those colorful books, not quite knowing how to read most of them yet, but still feeling something special. That line was written straight from the heart because when I was a young girl, I had a giant brown bookshelf that had what seemed like hundreds of books on it, and I used to just stare at the little at the title pages and such of all the books for hours on end, not knowing how to read them yet, but definitely being very interested in learning how to read them. And now that I've read most of those books, I can tell you that it was very interesting.